Hello and welcome back. Wow. Uh, that's a very red area that's kind of making me lose the game. Is a concern. But we can do something about it in two days. So. And next time, uh, any mission comes out about uh, making these missions available sooner, I'll be definitely doing that. Anyway, uh, seems like I'm gonna freeze downtown. And you definitely need these abilities quite a bit. Freeze, quarantine. District unrest, and we have to uh, deal with the stacks. And I also have enough money to buy the enhanced AR upgrade, which will only affect Verge, who currently is not even in the fucking team. So, yeah, I mean, that, yeah, let's not do it right now. But I, I'll probably have to do it eventually. <clears throat> I mean, I suppose I, I most of all have to upgrade the weapons of those who are always in the team and uh, sh spend shooting quite a lot, spend time shooting because Virch sometimes even uses two abilities in a turn, so not the most efficient uh, use of points there. Yeah, I mean, we are going for this mission. I really want to go for the Renovo Heights one. But other than that, I seem to be getting a hang of this game. And it seems like the... the Whatever. The black market disappeared. So if I have to next time choose, the, choose to go to the black market to have access to it, I'm definitely not doing that. It's not worth it. Okay, blue blood. I don't think we have any new items since then. We're good to go. <laughs> Pretty random selection of stuff. <laughs> it seems like one flashbang is okay. But one flashbang is a pretty good idea. Just just in case. Friendly VIP ahead. Check your fire. I'll, I'll do that. Okay. Scanners entering through here marks your units until the end of uh, the encounter. All units entering here get free mobility from our round. Um, that's good, maybe for someone who runs, but not even that. All non-aggressive enemies guarding this entrance are surprised. Oh, that sounds pretty good. All units entering here get 25 defense for one round. That's that's even better. Uh, how long is this encounter? Encounter of one of one. So okay, let's go. Time for fireworks. Okay, I would like to kill the Legionnaire. Now, who do we jump in on? The Python would be an excellent choice. The Python or the Trooper? Let's do Python. It's so a three to four. Uh, let's take the shot. Fuck me. Damage is so low. Uh, let's do Alpha Strike on the Legionnaire. I Get see that him. hostage to safety. So Godmother only slightly moves up in the turn order by using the Alpha Strike. <sighs> I can give Zephyr an extra action. I set him up, you knock him down. 
And he can go for uh, one hell of a roundhouse kick here. Uh, maybe in the back? Well, we killed the snake, so that's that's good. I'll bring you down. Oh fuck! I activated the guy. I hope he's not gonna get killed for that. Where should we, he hide? Yeah, let's put him over there. I can make him move again. Okay, let's move Godmother up. That seems like a good shot, but... Oh, I, I definitely would like to finish off the python. So what we got here... If I could take out... This big beast... That's... Something worth doing. Let's see. No. Yeah, I want to take out the Praetorian. Oh yeah, they definitely want to kill the hostage. Now that I have it. That's not necessarily a, a kill. It is a kill if I throw a frag grenade on him. Frag out. And then we punch him. Demolishing. And then we parry, so we are invincible as well. Hmm. I mean, that seems okay. But I'd rather take Think this fast. shot. Okay, let's take Heads it. Up. Wow. He's already out. Okay, let's go. Do we stay here? Oh, that's one fucking trooper. No one cares about that. Just go. Cover me. Next time, faster! Throwing grenade. Maybe this is how it should be played. <laughs> Not st sticking around for like 10 minutes extra of fighting the reinforcements. Fast as I can. Come on, hustle. Go. Oh, look at that! <laughs> Lightly wounded. Wow. I bet. Do, will I even get the the intel bonus? Actually, yeah, that's becoming a concern. I just. I just shoot people way too much, and we're not getting the intel bonus. I didn't get it. Damn. Uh, Agent Sido. I feel so tired.
tired, and it's not even noon. What did you have for breakfast? I'll tell you what she didn't have. Big Crunch. The cereal that writhes? That's the one. How does that even work? We dip gene tailored larval. So we get extra dodge for Verge. Simply add warm milk I don't and know. prepare for a big crunch. What I suppose kind of uh, upgrades are better. So we can promote agent. It is ready for some big terminal. Upgrades safeguard to provide I one armor to the protected unit. Course, I mean that's just straight up good. Terminal heals up to full at the end of every no encounter. Oh, what? Well, I know what I'm having. A wriggling bowl That's of not as good. But I, I guess these are marginal upgrades, considering. I think his terminal is not usually in that situation that she needs to fully heal uh, after every encounter. And of course, this is completely pointless if it's a one turn encounter. And. Even if it's a free turn encounter, it's only relevant for two turns, obviously, the first and second, because you don't need to fully heal after this, the third turn. So... This seems to... I don't know, I, I, don't, I don't like this. This doesn't seem to make too much sense, unless you play super recklessly in free turn encounters, which I assume are gonna be the, the main very difficult encounters. But... Does it still make sense to go for this? I mean, you can just basically mitigate this by just trying to go for some med kits. I mean, you this basically like frees up on my med kit slot. I mean, you shouldn't assume that you're gonna get like fucking almost dead in both first and second uh, encounters. Let's just say you would get wounded in one and you want to use a med kit because you just got wounded so much but many times uh she's not even the one that's getting hit she's just with full hp and doesn't care or about to leave with uh, a little bit uh uh <laughs> wounded hp but again it doesn't matter so it's uh, a very easy choice here a promotion rank uh special agent has unlocked uh phase lance what the fuck is that blue butt fires uh the Lancer pistol in a straight line blast. The shot ignores line of sight and is unaffected by cover. Bonuses, free turn cooldown. I mean that that is that is not as good as uh what uh Godmother has. But I suppose you can use it from farther away. It's also a hefty free turn cooldown. Okay then. I didn't realize that I'm I was choosing the agents forever. Because I just don't get new agents and I, I assume this is just how the game is meant to be played. That you just choose your favorite agents. And that's it. <laughs> and I definitely didn't do that. I was just like, yeah, whatever. Hey, what? What is this? Assemble and train staff for new field team. Requires special agent or higher. Requires one or more field finance field teams at rank two. So, if. Five turns, I will get a free fill team. Which, how much is that? That's kind of pricey. So upgrading this would be 120, which I plan on doing. So this would basically mean we get 24 uh, intel per day, but of course we would need to put in a, a higher level agent. And for this we get 
20 inter per day. So it is very marginal. And for this we get 25 credits per day. And credits are still good. And just getting intel is well, I don't know. It's it's close. It's it's damn close, but like getting intel is a little bit more versatile than just getting a, a free fill team. Uh, that's for sure. Expert field teams. I want for sure, I want someone in here getting some bonuses. It's not gonna be Illyrium Sting, for sure. It's not gonna be Legwork. It can be glad handing or recruiting that drive, whatever. It could be either. I think for now we're gonna go with uh, more money. Uh, we're gonna have Cherub here getting more money. And I'm not sure if we care about upgrades here. I mean, do dodge by 20 for the him. Does this matter? Maybe. Utility item slot by one. I mean, uh, I don't know. Mobility increased by one. Dodge increased by 15. I mean, these all matter. Marginally. Crit chance increased by 15. I mean, this might be even more relevant for this guy. But he's already a little weak. So I might just put blue blood in here and a virgin here. And now we have to make a choice uh, of either getting 35 lightning or getting 45 intel. And this should be an easy choice because Illyrium is by far the hardest to generate on on your own so it's gonna be 35 illyrium here easy choice and it's also uh, helps the daily progress and actually before we do that I should remove one from Renewable Heights I kind of want Dragnet okay get the illyrium was slow to impound restricted weapons after the war. Some locals took advantage. Cutting off the flow to Grey Phoenix will disrupt the local arms trade. Okay, then. Wait, crisis management? Oh shit, reduce city anarchy by free. I suppose that will be relevant at times. So we did unlock the scavenger and now we have continually continuous access to it. Which is nice. But what is not nice is wait, it's selling the same things? Kind of? But I still can't afford it. I go opening this thing was just the dumbest thing I've done. No. No, no, no. This fucking scavenger outpost. Like the fucking most icely of I can never afford anything here. No. Terrible. Supply. Enhanced AR. Yeah, I mean, we got a guy here who will benefit from the enhanced AR. So, I guess, get it. But it's damn close. The Mac Thief. I'm actually tempted to get Mac Thief for everybody. Will I not get anything better than the Mac Thief? Because that seems just ridiculously good. Actually, I'm a little bit more concerned about just doing enough damage. This affects Virgin Sentinel.
I don't much care about that. I mean, the Mac Weave seems fucking good. But if there's ever gonna be a, a replacement for it, an upgrade... Then I'm just gonna... Then I just spent like a crap ton of money on nothing. <clears throat> so, not the best. Will I go enhanced AR? So, currently the team is... We have someone with AR, we have someone with SMG, we have someone with shotgun, and we have someone who doesn't use either of those things. And I can't even upgrade it. So... She might fall off. Or he. I don't know. <laughs> but I think it makes sense to go for the enhanced AR now that I already invested so much into it. Now, what do we do? Lights out mission, and that's the only one we got. No field team. And it's a little bit pricey. Can't see what we got. Flux Weave armor mod, two unrest in Riverside District, and 25 intel. I mean, getting V for everybody is the reason why it doesn't make too much sense to invest in it is because we have Zephyr running in and just grabbing all the aggro. So, as long as that is fine, we don't need to invest. Dealing more damage is, is a little bit more relevant. Okay, let's go. Now, do we have... Basically, we have nothing to consider. And that's fine, because he's, he's not really a guy who wants to use items. He usually wants to use a Psychic Ability plus Shoot, or a Psychic Ability plus Psychic Ability. Terminal is usually maybe okay with using some Utility. But usually you wanna use heal plus shoot, something like that. Godmother, I mean, can use some utility. Zephyr doesn't mind utility use at all. Let's go. I see the target device. Destroy. How long is this mission? Encounter one out of two. Delay disable. Last unit through this entrance will have their weapon disabled. For this alone, because this is fairly common, uh, I'm kind of happy that we have Zephyr. This is just completely identical. There's no decision here at all. <laughs> Fine. Uh, let's go Verge, Godmother, Terminal, and Zephyr. We shall move in. Okay, I'm not gonna lift the snake, we just wanna kill it. Four to six, which can kill the trooper. And I guess we want to finish off the trooper. And we jump in on. Maybe the bruiser. In my reach. Is that so? 
Oh, you wanna duel? Right away. Oh, I'm immune to duels. <laughs> Stop the hostage taker? That guy? That's not a problem. So, the Legionnaire will act. But I can't kill it. So we're gonna disable him. Give me your mind. Stun for two. That's a little bit e hard to hit. Praetorian is tanky as hell. Hmm. Do we just shoot at the faceless? Oh, I know what we should do. Make the Praetorian hit the faceless? Go on. Lash out. Oh, I guess that works. <laughs> Not what I was uh, hoping for, but that's actually even better. Huh, okay. Let's go closer. Moving. And go for a big shot on the Praetorian. You want to do me? Bring it on! Oh, it's happening. Okay, let's do the heal. Which the also gives an armor. Work. If you think it's best. Mm -hmm. We can give Zephyr an extra turn. It's a free turn cooldown. Or oh, we just hit at the Legionnaire. Can I just shoot at the Praetorium? Yeah. But the chance to hit is pretty bad. Okay, fine. Mm. What? I mean, I think that's a lie. It's not exactly guaranteed. Uh, let's just parry. Okay. Let's run and subdue this guy. Oh shit, it might not work. Subdue the hostile. Mm. Cover me. Let's go in for a regular shot. Now we can subdue this faceless. You're getting arrested! Oh, actually, no. He's not getting arrested. Need a little help? We get a heal. Gremlin on the way. And then he gets arrested. Just a scratch. Another collar for the medic. Locate the power core? Oh, it's gotta be next room, right? All units entering here gain 25 aim during the breach. Uh, okay. All units entering here get 25 defense for round one. All units through this entrance get uh, 50 dodge for one round. I like to enter on the, on the same door. Because...
if you enter on multiple doors, you, you might just, like, for example, you go here alone. And you might just see, like, two aggressive enemies and you just get shot in the face. And you, because you can't deal with them alone. But you also can't get help from the main door. So, that's not the best. If possible, I just want to go with one room. Wait, what? No, 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 cancel. Yeah, what? No, no, abort mission. Let's go breach. Time to move. I just instinctively pressed uh, the, the thing in the right left corner. I mean, right, right bottom corner. Praetorian. We are not hitting reds. I guess I'm gonna go after the python. Oh, yeah, I mean, I'll just take a shot at the trooper. The hit chance is not the worst. Wow. Let me just kill one trooper. Disassemble that thing. What? Which one? This? So we can move terminal up. Oh, that seemed to make sense. So I can kill the snake. How do you play this? Actually, we might just come over here. Throw the frag grenade. Toward the snake. Tossing frag. Killing the snake. But just go for a regular hit. Which will give us. I like that, but also, who are we gonna hit? Okay, we got a Praetorian. And, next up... No. A lot of people are just hiding behind dumb covers. How about give Zephyr an extra turn? And you're gonna punch even more people. So he's stunned. That doesn't really matter. Hey, you got this. Well, he definitely does. Uh, we can just go after the bruiser. Um, a little awkward. Okay, let's go like that. <laughs> Weapon disabled. Well then. Okay, Virch, you're up. The Praetorium will act next. Putting him to sleep. That sounds pretty My good. Mind over yours. Okay. Can also make one guy go mental. But uh, let's just... Well, we can technically go and subdue... No, no, we can't reach the bruiser. 
Uh, we can shoot at the guy. It's, it's fine. What? So low damage. Okay. Let's go and kill the bruiser who is, uh, yeah, is really wounded. Hostile subdued. Praetorian is sleeping. We got one paladin here. But these are usually just boosters. Pretty bad. And uh, the Dominator is just chilling. Bruiser. Okay, let's kill Smashing the Bruiser. Extremity. <laughs> okay then. Just parry. If the Praetorium wakes up. Okay, it seems like there's n no one to heal. So you probably want to move in closer. And take a shot. Uh, let's take a shot at the Dominator. So Verge. Yeah. Still not a kill, right? Destroy the power cord to stop reinforcements. Oh my god, I have to do that? I didn't even know. Are they coming in already? Because it doesn't seem that way. I think they are. But I can't destroy it right now. Well, oh well. Okay, I just killed the paladin. Position. Never stop moving. Oh, he's sleeping too. Only the Praetorian is up. Sure, you can do any all you like. Okay. Three Heading guys over. enter the area. They're pretty low level. Come on. Boston Kill them. Man. No. Didn't die. We got this guy who's fairly wounded, but definitely not dead. There's no way to kill him. No, we didn't hit the tank. That was uh that was an interesting test as well. Hmm. Okay, fine. Move over there. Gotta get moving. And just hit the big thing. Oh, doesn't matter. It's not gonna blow up. Oh no, Verge. So that trooper. Fine. Let's disable him. Your mind falls away. Now, do we see the the thingy from here? Ah, uh, looks like we do. It's not gonna blow up right now. Mm -hmm. 
On the move. I don't know. Damn. Will I dump Zephyr too? We gotta take it out. Okay, let's shoot like that. Zephyr has a shield. It's kind of fine. It seems like his shield stacks. He's just dumb. Okay, he kind of ran out. But it seems like he still had it. Yeah, just just parry. <sighs> Can he reach? Not really. Godmother, what about you? Ninety two. What? We gotta finish this. Subdue. These are the only two guys left. Heading over. Yeah, whatever. Not much ammunition. How much damage I can deal to those who I linked? Because. Two to three damage. Wait, I also damage myself? Oh, I'm on the neural network as well. That's a good point. Wow. Such a tanky boy. Rolling out. At least he's blind. I'm running low. What? Uh, just capture. I'm not sure how many we got. But might as well play it safe. Done! Wow. It's excellent! That's how it goes! Wounded, likely wounded, unharmed, and likely... Well, likely wounded. That's how excellent looks like. Just in case you were wondering. These fights are pretty damn long. But maybe not as... Well, definitely not as long as... Uh, as XCOM tends to be. Unrest in Riverside has lowered by one. Okay, City Anarchy, has, City Anarchy has risen to 7. Wow. I, I really like that they just give me the good news with the bad news. It's like, you know, you should feel a little bad, but, you know, but no. Because the city is in chaos. So I just must assume that you we will never get a guys, you guys yourself. here. Oh, no, no, no. My family was a teen. But somehow she ran it without ever taking charge. She wasn't overbearing? Did she push you too hard? No. She pushed just enough for us to live up to our own potential. She'd be pleased to know you exceeded yours. Wow. See? That's exactly the kind of thing she would say. Come on. You're so rude, Godmother. So fucking rude. We all know that guy sucks. <laughs> exceeded yours. It's the rudest thing I ever ever heard in my life. Okay, do we want enhanced pistols? I'm not sure. 
Mastercraft armor. I mean, that would be a pretty good idea. It would take me eight turns to have Mastercraft armor for everybody. I mean, it is a big uh, investment. But that's probably gonna pay off. The alternative is that we just uh, one up upgrade weapons that are relevant for me. And which are those weapons? A little unclear. Because it's just really one off. I mean, we have melee, we can upgrade that. We have uh, assault rifle, we upgraded that. We have SMG and we have a uh, shotgun. And that's all we got. Okay, we need to go the... And, and do the stop smash and grab mission because... Yeah. It's been a while and we have to do it. Right now. I'm thinking what, what to go for, research-wise. But I think it's gotta be the Mastercraft armor. Yeah, we are committing to it. Without help, it's 15 rounds. So technically I should have him in for 7 rounds only. Less, the rest will be done automatically. Okay, let's have blue blood in here. And everyone else will just fucking go mission. I don't know what to get here that would be relevant, other than the Mac Weave. Actually, we got some stuff, right? Uh, let's go on the mission. Fuck. Go on the mission! Two unrest in Renova Heights District. We got 110 intel. 10 intel every Friday. I guess we can buy that. Wait, what day it is? It's Friday. Did I already get the... Get the stuff? Hmm. I just get this. I think we already got it. Upcase for 80 that I can't afford. So, yeah, let's just go. Great. I'm really low on Illyrium now. Apparently we got 20 per week, 20 per week, 50 per week. That's something. Actually, I'm wrong with the upgrades. Wait. No, no, no. I'm, I'm right. I can order the upgrades uh, district to tier 3. I already made that uh, research. That's fine. Um, then we can do Mastercrafted Armor. Uh, yeah, Field uh, Team Payday. We already had that. Investigation. That just happens automatically. Okay. Let's get rid of a red, a red zone. Field team in every district. How close I am to that? One, two, three, four, five. I mean, that's all we got. And this would give me reduced city anarchy. Is this, is this, I think this is on cooldown, right? So this is still stupidly relevant. So it seems like our strategy is gonna be that I get this district up to rank 3, then I get districts everywhere, and that's it. Then and then that's gonna give me access to all the abilities. And uh, yeah, that should be good. And based on what's going on, I don't think we're ever gonna get you guys. This is just the A team. <laughs> and it's never gonna get any better than that. Okay, let's go. 
What kind of stuff we got? So we got Flux Weave, grants immunity to disorientation and stun. That's pretty useless. It's because it's very situational. But I guess we're gonna use it. Let's go, <laughs> Sentinel guy. One day your your time will what? I said go. Launch. One day your time will come. I, I guess. Hopefully not. Really hoping not. Gray Phoenix raided a local manufacturer. Looks like some sort of smash and grab. Headquarters okay. wants this handled fast. I'm not sure why. They won't share? No, it's... Look, some information on this company is restricted. Can you call the director? Good idea. I'll see if she can cut through the red tape. Okay. I don't usually hear her talk, but it's quite obvious that she's not a One Punch Man, I, I guess. At least not the man part. All units through this entrance get 50 dodge for one round. Okay. Successful shots and enemies will crit. Ooh, that's pretty good. We only see three guys here. This seems pretty easy. Enemies are harder to hit. Successful shots on enemies will crit, but does this also apply to melee attacks? We have to do it for science. Go, go, go! Oh, come on. Why use the leg? Just use your head. Okay, we got Python. And a Dominator. And an Adder in the back. We definitely can kill the Adder in the back. So far away. Okay, let's do Fearless Advance. Oh, we got crit. These are rather close. Okay, I'm fine. Oh, we got a shotgun here. crits where's the dominator oh up top okay maybe punch the dominator I don't really want to get mind controlled. Come on, Victoria. You want duel? You have to come and get me. Okay. So, let's get a little closer and deal with the faceless. We don't really have to do that. It's a bit risky way to do that. Okay. I don't know. Should I get in closer? Let's get in a little Moving. closer. Although... Call that fast. All right. I just don't want to miss. Seven of six. Let's subdue the faceless. Hostile is under arrest. 
arrested the faceless. Maybe we'll break out of jail by pretending to be someone else. Okay. Uh, let's get a little closer. And I guess we're gonna give an extra action to Zephyr. Up, you knock him down. Yo, just goes in for another punch. Fracturing. We've <laughs> been disabled. Yeah, we kind of struggled to deal with the Praetorian. Not super uh, ready to do with such high armor. Good news is the Praetorian can't deal with me either. What? Okay, let's just go there. Can I see the Praetorium from somewhere? I guess we can go over here. I guess we're gonna help out from the left side. Okay, go for more punches. Bring it on, Praetorian. Rooted to two. Great. And we have parry on. So he has no chance of hitting us. Okay. Let's subdue him. cleared things up. This company has some not-so-public ties to XCOM proper. No way! They make a weapon component for the new interceptors. And I'm still running down the specifics. Yeah, let's breach. Helping hand, last units through this entrance will receive an extra action point. Sounds good. There are fewer aggressive enemies present at this entrance. Last unit through this entrance. Does free damage during the breach. Okay, let's go. What? No, no, no. We're good. Open sesame. It's only a chance. Legionnaire. Let's take out the Legionnaire because the others are surprised. You will at least hide. Interesting. Very diverse workforce you got here. I can commend you for just having faceless and Praetorians and... Uh, I, I don't even know the name of half of these things. I've give uh, Zephyr an extra action. Ooh, 
which allows him to just kick everybody in the face if he wants to. But maybe not do that. Let's just punch Python. No! And go for a, a tankiness. Uh, what? Oh yeah, Dominator is pretty annoying. Can you just shoot the Dominator? No, we can punch the Dominator. We can't shoot him. No, no, oh, no. Okay. Let's shoot the Paladin. I hate the Dominator. So damn good. Okay, let's disable the Praetorian. If we can. What? Okay. We're gonna subdue... A Python. From over here. Which... Will subdue hopefully give me... Line of sight, actually, I fucked up. But it was still okay. God, there is no longer stunned. Hmm. This is the last concern. She can't move, for some reason. Let's just kill the Paladin. Oh, it's the side disable. Okay, let's punch the Dominator. Go for the regular armor. Mm. Actually, I probably should have went for a subdue. Mind control is so fucking damn good. Okay. Uh, let's go over here. And take a shot at the mind controller. No! This was not the time to miss. Unfortunately, we have to come downstairs and just shoot him. That's the only guaranteed way to do it. Oh my god. Only one round remaining. That's okay, Zephyr can get it. Come on, go there. So you pick up the thing very quickly. Then go for a uh, punch in the face. Splintering. And was nearly out. Do I need heals? Seems like no one takes any damage. Okay.
He has a crap ton of armor. Okay. Let's subdue him. Hostile subdued. Enough of that shit. Locate the power converter. Okay, that's gonna be uh encounter free, right? I found out what Grey Phoenix stole. It's a power converter. Military grade. Interesting. And alarming. Why not have why not don't we have this information before the fucking mission? Am I the only one feels like I'm just I just don't have critical information to be successful in this mission? All units entered here get free mobility for one round. Not really relevant. There are fewer aggressive enemies present at this entrance. Entering through here marks your units until the end of encounter. I don't mind. Oh, I guess she has to be first. Alright, let's go like that. It's go time! Fewer aggressive enemies. Sounds good to me. Oh crap! What's going on here? So we got a paladin. Uh, 7 HP. Faceless. Berserker. A legionnaire. And a Praetorian. Very good mix. Let's kill the paladin. The Praetorian is hard to kill. The legion is a little hard to kill. Do we just kill the paladin? Oh no, actually I'm I'm thinking about the wrong I'm thinking with the wrong guy. Uh, let's go after the legionnaire. I just kill the paladin. Okay. Maybe Alpha Strike on the faceless. Okay, might as well use everything right now. We have to. Locate That's the power converter and acquire it. it. Out. Now we team up with Godmother, I think. I can go for heals, but maybe I just want to give actions. I can also just take shots. Pretty good shots myself. Although that will not kill the other. Go! Go now! Alright, go Zephyr. So this adder will act soon. So we're just gonna take it out. And we go for a parry. Just to block. Torian is next. I guess killing the Legionnaire would be nice. We don't have to worry about that anymore. The Praetorian is a little annoying. I can deal a crap ton of damage to him. Uh, let's just try to kill the Praetorian. I guess we have a good spot. We don't have to move. Torin is hard to kill. It's fine. Uh, as much as I would like to hit the Praetorian, I think hitting the Faceless is 
uh, a better option. Smashing extremity. He's gonna be just finished off. And just go for a parry. Okay. Let's put the Berserker to sleep. And just keep killing the Praetorian. Let me slow down. Does this take out the Praetorium? How, how does it work? He has armor, but Another collar for he's the in the range of uh, getting knocked out, I suppose. Crap, reinforcements are coming in. Let's open the chest. And... This guy in the face, then punch him in the face. He's a little mad. Don't worry, you'll be dead soon. Uh, yeah, just punch him in the face. Killing him. He's rooted now. Can okay, I just parry? And last. We cannot go in for a subdue. Hmm. I can go in for a mind flay. Actually, I'm gonna deal damage to myself that way. Okay. Time to fucking bail. Ah! Two snakes plus a fishman. Three snakes. That's, that's still two snakes. Mm. Just try to get out as soon as possible. No ammo. That's fine. Just just get the hell out. Preparing to travel. What? Go away. Wow. Really destroyed that box, mate. Okay. You'll get out. Not a problem. No, 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 no. Don't, don't catch me, though. Why are you so fucking slow? Can I somehow increase your speed? Because this is a fucking joke. Wow. This, this speed is a crime against humanity. That's even worse. He just gets captured again because he's so fucking slow. I reposition. Others were ready to go like two two turns ago. Why is he so fucking slow? Oh, let's throw a flashbang grenade. 
I don't care. Frying some corneas. Avert your eyes. Oh, I'm gonna give him extra action. Oh, no, no. Yes! Yes! Hell yeah. You get extra action, mate. Oh, shit. He can get out. Wow. This is your lucky day. Your luckiest. Not only she had the perfect item to help him, but also... <laughs> oh, give him an extra action. Wow. Burge, what the fuck, mate? You must really want to die. We captured 15 guys. We got some intel for that. Oh, punched in the face. I'm pretty sure we captured more <laughs> people <laughs> than we killed. I mean, by V, I mean um, Zephyr. Okay, minus 2 on rest, 30 credits, and 30 Illyrium, 20 intel. Sure, it's just a little bit of everything. Great job. No arms dealer is willing to risk a deal with Grey Phoenix. Not with Chimera Squad in town. Hell yeah. Will I ever Looking get new agents? Adventure, or just something for the little one? I would like that. Come on. Down Come on. To the I don't care if they are level one. Give me just some new agents. I don't even care if I can put them into the spec ops. Just give me new agents. Okay, we got 75 credits. Crisis management. Do we need to do that? Okay, promotion is ready. Holy shit. She's getting some promotions. I wonder why. Okay, let's see what we got. Momentum is also triggered by subdue and crowd control. I mean, we're already doing that. Melee attacks that would deal lethal damage will instead render enemies unconscious. Melee attacks do plus one damage, replace subdue. Yeah. So this, I suppose, doesn't really make sense with that. Momentum is also triggered by subdue. Because we already kind of have that. And Zephyr does not trigger overwatch or reaction fire. This is not as good. Melee attacks will ignore armor. Holy fuck. <laughs> Holy fuck, Praetorian, is, you're so fucked now. You're super fucked. This is effectively extra damage against, against almost all enemies. Basically, this is one extra damage. Instead of dealing uh, 5 to 6, we're gonna deal, yeah, I mean, at least plus 1. So this is gonna allow us to kill most enemies. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> are you fucking kidding me? Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah, we're doing that. What else we got? Ah, uh, yeah, I suppose that doesn't make sense. Agent's Idol. <sighs> Let's see what kind of trainings we can do. Cherub doesn't have trainings available. I suppose the trainings become available as you gain levels. He can dodge. Can he run fucking faster? A I have to fucking ago, check this out. Phoenix forced their way into the city starport. Oh, look at that. If they That's a fucking a awesome looking city. They could cause all kinds of destruction. Look at that. Everything is great. Okay. Almost everything is great. It's not completely hopeless. Okay. Uh, one thing I want to check out is how fucking slow are you? So we got... Uh, 13 health, 12 mobility. Nice. We got 14 health, 10 mobility. But yet, still seems to be enough. She's not fast, but she's okay. Cherub. Uh, anyone remembers this guy? He used to be on the team. <laughs> I was like, why do I have 7 guys? But I guess we have this android. He also have mobility of 10. No fucking way! Get some fucking shoes to this guy! He is the worst! Second time now, like, in a very me very big way, he was way in the back. Actually, wow, we have kills? Okay, let's see. So, 15 kills for 13 missions. Okay, one per mission, she is doing solid. 12 kills for 60 missions, which is very respectable for a support. Very respectable. I mean, you don't want 
the support just glory hugging all the kills. Two kills for four missions. Yeah, I mean, okay. Fair enough. I mean, he's a tank guy. 20 kills for 13 missions. Interesting. Kicking more ass than Godmother. Okay, fair enough. Let's see, what well, what about this guy? He has 23 kills for 8 missions. Holy fuck. I was totally underrating this guy. <laughs> I said he was... I said he sucked. Oh my god, you guys must know about this. 23 kills for 8 missions? Oh my god. So, he was actually pretty okay. <laughs> Let's see about the... Yeah, no, no. He didn't get a chance. And what about her? She only had... 11 kills for 14 missions? It doesn't feel that way. It seems like she's carrying quite hard. Blue Blood, Blue Blood was just a dirty finisher. She, uh, he was just a dirty kill stealer. But Zephyr just goes in and just get, punches the Praetorian for, for multiple rounds. And it's fucking impressive. So I think Zephyr is like a, a, a tanky, tanky damage character also just like tanks like tanks like a madman wow uh anyway where was i so apparently he has no reason to stay behind that much but he still does it anything i can get so she can get a little faster which would i suppose help a little bit but it's like it's not a big deal like, anything is a big deal, we might consider it, but, like, only a big deal. Godmother, mobility increased by 1, dodge increased by 15. I mean, maybe this would be relevant for him, because Verge is just terrible. I mean, he, he seems to be excellent at, at getting killed. So, we gonna select Cherub here. And he's just gonna go and... Yeah, senior agent or higher, senior agent or higher. This agent does not uh, meet the rank. Maybe he should go and miss some missions. But he's so good at making money at home. So, let's begin with that. And we are doing the mastercrafted armor. And I'm not sure how much it's gonna cost, but... I mean, we are saving up for that. And after that, I guess we're just gonna go for some, some upgrades. Actually, it would make a lot of sense if after after the master crafted armor, we get the enhanced pistols, and this guy with the enhanced pistols, I think he's gonna kick ass, and he was kicking ass pretty, pretty well. But like, yeah, oh, yeah. I don't know. It still didn't feel like it. I don't know. He was just uh, the kill stealer guy. Anyway, uh, that's it for now. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.